What's going on guys and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today is an update video for the Conquest Resource Pack and I know it's a little bit late but yes there is an update to the Conquest Resource Pack and I'm just going to go through it as quick as possible. First of all we got a retextured version of the red clay ruse. The old texture was much larger slate and as you can see this is more rounded. Looks a lot better I think and I'm really happy with this new texture so good job to Monsterfish for that. Now this is something that I am extremely um, happy about is this new dark slate cobble. The way that you get this is you just go ahead and get the normal cobble. Um, let's just grab some normal cobble. So bring the cobble off our inventory and use our metacycler to go through and wham, there it is right there. The new dark cobble, very nice. Now this is a new dragon age, dragon egg texture. So all you gotta do is do slash I122 and go through the metadata until you get that. Very nice, looks very interesting. Um, I don't know, I don't like the holes on the side like that. It looks very artificial. Um, I don't know, it's supposed to be a beehive. Uh, let me see, is that what it says? Um, new cold beehive dragon egg. Yeah, it's supposed to be a beehive. I don't know, it looks more like rope, like a spool of rope or something. I don't know, but anyway, we also have new desert biome dispensers, um, droppers, and furnaces. That is a new texture that's very nice, very happy to have that. And uh, we also, there's the furnaces down there as you can see, and there's one burning. Um, but yeah, these are new desert biomes, so make sure, uh, all you gotta do is just place a normal dispenser or whatever from your inventory, and you can go ahead and place those, so it's really quite simple. Um, and wow, I did not notice these. This is this is definitely interesting. Um, wow. Okay, so this is actually dispenser pointing up. So it looks like a drain or something of that sort. That's very interesting. And then you got yourself a raven symbol, some kind of um, upward pointing hole there. But that looks really cool. I didn't know there was that texture. That's really interesting. Definitely will have to um, remember that and uh, put that into the... Uh, texture plot. Anyways, we also have a new mossy cobblestone as you can see here. This is just something that you can, uh, it's just another cobble, or another, uh, not mossy cobble, mossy sandstone. All you gotta do is just take normal sandstone and go through the metadata and you'll be able to get that. So we'll just go ahead and grab some sandstone really quick and yeah, whatever. Anyways, it just turns into sandstone. And then you got some new grass. Now the grass, how you use this is it's actually a metadata. Um, you just go through them all and then bam it restarts and then there you go because there's 16 metadata and there's eight layers to the snow block um, but anyway on the eighth layer it changes in that so this isn't biome specific so therefore you can use it a lot more but there is the dirt um, version as well that you can use uh, but the dirt version is biome specific um, and I think that is all that for up here. We got all the cobble, we got the furnaces, got all that. So that's very interesting, very good. And the coolest thing is that now we have flying birds. Now some of you are quite, are like, well, how do we do this? Well the way you do it is you place, so there's your base bird. All you gotta do is place another bird on top. And there you go. And we'll do the same thing here. So this one will be a hawk. And then all you gotta do is change the biome through till you get to the right one. And there you go, now you got a flying seagull. So you got a flying hawk, flying seagull, a flying blue jay, crow, owl, and a bat. So it's all very interesting. The bird textures are phenomenal. He did a magnificent job on them. I'm very happy with the textures. But anyway, um, just that, just a quick update uh, for those of you that weren't aware. Uh, thank you for watching. Till next time, uh, bye bye.